In this video of DIY IoT washing machine, I will be sharing two python codes, yes two of them. First code is for semi-automatic washing machine and second code is for fully automatic washing machine. Link for the code is in description. Before explaining the code, a disclaimer, this is the first time I am doing this python coding. I don't have any prior experience in python, in fact in any of the coding languages. So I have googled these queries and I have just uh, copy, you can say this is a copy paste job but with some tweaking to get the desired result. Uh, due to which I may use some of the terminologies which may not be correct as per coding standards and even this code may be can be optimized in much better way. So please bear with me. Before proceeding, I want to request you to please subscribe to this channel and help this channel grow. Thank you. Now I'll briefly explain one of this python code that is semi-auto.py because this is a very this is a smaller code and very easy to understand as compared to fully auto.py in fully auto.py there is a additional sensor bmp280 because of which the code becomes a bit complex as compared to semi-auto.py this is semi-auto.py and these are the libraries that are imported and this is gpr set mode gpr set mode as board means board pins and th these are the pin list this will be used below in the code and for this pin list these are the corresponding uh, pin numbers and what this pin number represent uh, is given here means if this particular pin list is used or triggered then this particular function will work next is wash loop wash loop defined here is 20 one wash loop is equal to one forward rotation of wash motor for 10 seconds then a pause of six seconds and then again 10 seconds reverse rotation of wash motor that is one wash loop so like that 20 wash loop is defined in this code so that that will cover up the entire washing of the clothes next is wash cycle now this wash cycle is equal to entire operation of this wash loop 20 times and spin loop 2 times. So entire operation of this is equal to one wash cycle. This can be increased to one or two based upon the user requirement. If after washing the rinsing of the clothes has to be done, then at that time this function can be used. Next is the sleep time. Sleep time defined over here is 6 seconds. Now this is equal to, this is a pause in between of uh, forward rotation of wash motor and the reverse rotation of the wash motor. So this should be minimum 5 seconds because uh, if it is less than that then the relay will freeze in the long run. Because the relay channel what we use are not of a, a good quality because in long run it tends to freeze. Next is wash time. Wash time, this is the working. This is wash time is 10 seconds when the wash motor rotates in either in forward rotation or in reverse rotation. Drain time. This drain time is when the water is really uh, drained from the wash tub. Spin time is when uh, the spinner is used. This can be increased. This, this can be increased as per the required uh, duration. Next is this start time one, which is used to determine the run time, which will be used below in the code. Next is this uh, pin list I is recalled to give this command like GPIO out and GPIO high, all those pins in the pin list one. Next is this question. This is related to this particular entire field from line number 29 to line number 46 this is related to a request for safety first in mechanical as well as electrical parts uh, that you will be observing all the safety precautions while working with this project in short you can directly delete this code from line number 29 to 46 this will not affect any other functions in the code next is wash cycle this particular loops covers almost entire code uh, which covers up washing, spinning and drain operation. Below this we have this wash loop 
the watch loop defined in this code is 20 number uh, is 20 so 20 times this particular loop will run and this particular command turns on the relay on which in turns turns on the forward rotation of the watch motor for this particular time watch time which is defined as 10 seconds and to turn off this particular and to stop this operation this command is used to turn off the relay one and this is the sleep time that is almost for six seconds this motor will be turned off then this command is used to turn it in reverse rotation when the relay 2 is turned on and to stop this this particular command is used to turn off the relay so this is the whole wash loop so 20 times this particular wash loop will run next is drain command this particular code is used to turn on relay 3 for drain command to drain the water from the wash tub next is spinner command this particular code is used to turn on the spinner and this is the code for the spinner pause next we have after spinner is completed the drain motor is turned off by this particular code and after this the code exit if you still have any queries you can comment me and i'll try to answer it thank you